Peyton Manning, now having started all 122 games of his incredible career. 17 touchdowns this season after the 49 of a year ago. Tarek Glenn on an offensive line that's been steady and healthy all year long. Marvin Harrison two catches away from 900, another milestone. This Cincinnati defense is one aggressive bunch. Smith on the line. This defense averages over more than three takeaways per game. They lead the league. One of the reasons, the middle linebacker, the rookie from Georgia, Odell Thurman, who has four picks. And Delta O'Neal has six interceptions on the season. And the Colts now first down at the 38. Clark in a slot to the left. Take the handoff to James, going to the right side. Harrison has the grab near the first down yardage. In fact, they'll mark it all the way up to the 50. Good for a first, gain of 12. Chuck Branch the hand, look at this. Just one guy out here, safety in the middle. Defensive coordinator for the Bengals says you cannot fool Peyton Manning when he sees nobody but one corner to the outside. Marvin Harrison, you got to respect the speed. They're going to have to give up the long passes to the outside in situations like that. Catch number 899 in Harrison's storied career. He has averaged more than six catches a game in his career. That's the best all time in the history of the league. What kind of culture and environment do you set for your football team? Marvin Lewis lets him get away with it. And it's pass and almost a circus catch by Harrison. That's the first incompletion after Manning hit his first seven, including the long one to Wayne for the touchdown. Only two minutes into the third quarter after all. That's right. Don't panic and make a rash decision when you don't have to. Manning to the sideline was a second foot down. They say no for Marvin Harrison. Second time all day that Peyton Manning has been under pressure. Can the Bengals find a way to get him off rhythm? And what a good try by Marvin Harrison, but a good call by the officials. So seven straight rushes by Edge, and he's out. On first down, Manning to Harrison, and just a little too far. Delta O'Neal on the coverage. It's a six-and-a-half-minute drive, something we're unaccustomed to today. Glenn is out. Scott goes to left tackle from right guard. Third down, pass play, caught, and almost able to get it in. Marvin Harrison twisted down outside of the goal line by Delta O'Neal. I've always said this, Peyton Manning, excellent short thrower over the line of scrimmage because of his style of throwing the football. 42-34, if you're just joining us, that's right. The highest scoring first half in the league in about 20 years we had here. Manning hit when he threw it. And he was decked. And that's what he has here, needing 13, needing just to get past midfield. More pressure, flag is thrown and almost intercepted. Flag in the backfield in the area of offensive holding. Palmer becomes the highest rated quarterback in the league. Defense has to come up. They're down eight. You can't afford to give up a field goal. Lowen. Snagged by Harrison. Play right where it had to be by Peyton. 15-yard game. Yeah, it's really, this is terrific execution. And you're playing Marvin Harrison. He's fast. He's shifty. you got to honor him going deep. And the Colts, they throw that route against every team four or five times a game. And they hit it probably 80% of the time. He's got a season-high 350. And Harrison on the slant. Gives him 10 more. Another good catch. Say the skill positions for both of these offenses, it's it's at the top of the league. There's no doubt about it. Third and goal.
Pass incomplete. Thought he could hit Harrison, but Delta O'Neill reached in and batted away. Yeah, this is on the top of your screen. Marvin Harrison comes in. Good timing by Delta O'Neill. It's fourth and one. And the Colts, no choice what you're going to do here. Fourth and one, you have to kick the field goal to go up by 11 points. For Manning and the Colts, who have attempted two passes on this series, used up no time. Open man, and Harrison was out. Incomplete. He was open. Yeah, that's going to be a frustrating series for the Indianapolis Colts. Three times they probably they had the receivers open. Peyton Manning all three times was under pressure and just a little bit off the mark. And look at Tony Dungy's face. He's gone. I can't believe it. Pittsburgh and Cincinnati both fall today in the north. Cincinnati will take on Baltimore next week. Pittsburgh travels to Indianapolis. Hey, on this uh, beginning now of this week of thanks, this season of thanks, we extend ours to this entire crew, led by Lance Barrow and Mike Arnold, all the men and women of this crew now heading down to Texas. We're, we'll look forward to bringing you the Cowboys and the Broncos on Thanksgiving afternoon.